tears for her child. I don't see a mom that is grieving. I'm sorry. I just don't. It's my opinion to have. And you know what? Furthermore, it's my audience opinion to have. We all have been watching this. We're going back from the ground up. We've had several experts come into this case. We're not going to keep dismissing the experts at the likes of these hate channels that are criminals and have no flippin' education. Have never even stepped one foot in a college. Most of them didn't even graduate high school and couldn't even get a job at the Slurpee counter at 7-Eleven. And we're going to discredit, like, real investigators and real professionals that deal with psychology and have been uh, employed by the FBI and, you know, have these great skills that are used all over the country. We're not going to listen to them for the likes of these animals that have no education and, 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 and these, these horrible records while pointing at me for my little chump change? Does it make sense? Does it make sense? But all their little friends that are coming up, I'm going to give you a little tidbit of advice. Okay? And this is, when you go into those hate channels, they're going to use you, chew you, and spit you out. What do I mean by that? As soon as you, as a small creator, you're there trying to get attention to bring people over. Those aren't the channels to get attention from. Because as soon as you start taking their audience or their subscribers start turning it, tuning into you instead of them, or you run your show at the same time that they run their show, you're going to be chewed up and spit out. These people have no loyalty, no integrity. They don't care anything but more all about the clicks and the views and how much they can get their audience to do their bidding for them. 